On October 13, 2022 in Florida, Officer Gordon responded to a report of a minor car accident. The caller reported that the driver of the car that hit him appeared to be intoxicated. Here's a video of the events that followed. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel so you don't miss out on great videos in the future. Keep crossing me out for no reason. One zero six. What the fuck do you want, bitch? Uh, do you have your license? Yep. I do have my I will license. Take what you want? Do you have my license for? Get the fuck out I need of my your, I need your ID, ma'am. For what? You just been... For what? Califax for what? You've been involved in a for crash. For what? I ain't been involved, involved in, in no crash, you have this, bitch. You have this car hit, okay? This car ain't been hit. All right. I need your license, please. You don't need shit. Go ahead and turn your car off. Bye. Ma'am, no, we're, Bye. Not, we're not playing that. Ma'am. Get the fuck out of my car, oh, bitch. Open the door. Oh, yeah. You got me fucked up. Oh, yeah. You got me fucked up. Oh, yeah. You got me fucked up. Oh, yeah, you got me fucked up. Hey, guess what? All this shit, all on call. On call. Okay. Keep putting Ma me under arrest for put, no put reason. Put your hands behind your back. Yep. Put your hands behind your back. Yep. He got me under arrest for no reason. Yep. Yeah. Uh, no, you ain't touching my fucking phone. Get back. Guess what? Hey, one they touching my phone, y'all. Yeah. Record this shit, real shit. Record this shit right now. Holy shit. Bitch, right. oh shit. Ma'am, all right. Get off me. You're okay. One zero two. Do you have a patrol unit coming down here? Chill. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't try to take. That. Don't try to get out the car. Don't try to get out the cup. In a car. In a car. Stop. Oh. Stay in the car. Stay in the car. Okay. Yeah, she's going to jail just a minute. I'm south from Halifax. We're in the northbound lane block. Stop for Stop. No, she's the train. Stop. Get the fuck off me! Stop, stop. Get your vehicle up and come south from Halifax in front of this vehicle so we can put her in like, your car. Headquarters, uh, hey, I do not need to stand up. She's detained. She's just loud. Okay. Chill. Okay. Stay in the car. Watch it. Pull your car closer to here. Ah. I ain't coming on shit. Come on. Get off my face. Come on. Stand, up. Stand 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 up. Sit down. Okay. Sorry, we couldn't hear you on the radio. You get it here? All right, what you're going to do is you're going to turn around. Yep. We're going to come up there and we're going to park on the side of the street. She hit this truck. I think she's single 21, and you saw what we got. Yeah. Hey, sir, whatever the need to do, pull up there. Yes, sir, no problem. Okay? Okay. I'm going to pull her car up there. Yep, I'll follow you. You alright, sir? Yeah. You don't need a mess or anything? I just didn't want her to drive no more. So I say, ma'am, I'm just trying to tell you. It ain't no big deal, but I could tell she didn't need to drive. That's why I called. 
And the officer found he was walking up when I was on the phone with 911. Oh, thank you, man. Thank you. I appreciate it. It's a good example of how to de-escalate and just wait for cool heads. Yeah, I tried. So, thanks, man. Ma'am, so my name is Officer Weenie. Okay. I work for the Pensacola Police Department. What, you want to tell me what's going on today? <laughs> me, what's telling you on? What's going on today? Are you okay? What, what's going on? No, I'm not okay. Why is that? Because I thought... <laughs> I thought I was going to be okay. But you're not okay? No. Why is that? I thought I was going to be taken home, but I'm not. Taken home from where? From whatever. Okay. Do you know what happened just now? No. no? I don't know what happened. Okay. I just know I'm in handcuffs. That's what I remember. You don't remember anything before then? No. Like, what the fuck am I supposed to okay. understand before then? Like, okay, I'm in sure. handcuffs. Like, okay. <laughs> can you sit up for me? <laughs> no. Here, let me help you sit up, okay? We're gonna sit up, okay? Sit up for me just for a second, then I'll let you lay back down, okay? Here, face your feet that way for me, okay? Can you face your feet that way for me, please? No, sit up for me. Face your feet that way for me. No, we're not getting out of the car. What do you want me to do? Face your feet that way. There we go. I'll do it. Put yours on. Make sure the holes are facing up to undo it. Okay. And then we'll take those ones off. So they're going to be uncomfortable. Okay. Um, which one are my ass ones? Alright. I'm, I'm putting some new ones on for you. These ones yeah, because hey, they're just don't. getting off of me. Okay. I already know. You're okay. No, I'm okay because hey. guess what? Y'all Hey, stop. Y'all think I'm fucking stop. slick? Y'all put these bitches on somebody else? Y'all right. think I'll put these bitches on? Hey, uh, just take mine and it will get to yours tomorrow. Huh? Oh, yeah, yeah. He can. No, I don't need him now. No, I got it. I got it. Not you. Okay. <laughs> I forgot. I got it. We don't really want to. Uh, yeah. Uh, with it. In the car, I was called to disturbance. When I got there, uh, she was in the driver's seat, single occupant. Uh, I asked her to step on the car. She started dog cussing me up and down. She tried to roll up the window. I had to push it down, lock the car from side, turn the car off, and then detain her. And she, she tried to get out of the car. I told her to stay in the car because it was the truck. She tried to kick me. Uh, she just refused every command for me. I swear to firm memory. You want to press charges? Oh, I'm okay. No, we. She just has. To me, she resisted everything. Uh, uh, she doesn't need to act like that. Okay. <laughs> she immediately escalated the situation, turning a simple fine into a felony. It was astonishing how she believed that screaming, resisting, and threatening would force the officers to comply. The way she quickly switched from aggression to crying, and then back to aggression when she didn't get any sympathy showed how manipulative she really was. The, the way she's acting right now at the moment, she'll probably, she probably won't do FSTs. We're not going to take her out of handcuffs to do Yeah, so we're just going to transport can, yeah, we the UI. Because she's, uh, uh, she's already shown that she's being aggressive. Yeah. yeah. Okay. And if she's going to stay this aggressive, we're not going to take her into our BTO room. Yeah, no. Because she's not going to be cooperative in there either. Okay. You know you ain't shit! You know you ain't shit! You wanna catch another charge? Catch another charge? Y'all should be motherfucking give me this shit! Can you sit up for me? No! What? I cannot sit up okay. for you because Come on. guess what? Tap out! Stop! No, I'm not gonna stop because guess what? You don't give a fuck! Stop pulling! Stop! Step up! Step out. We can do this the easy way. Oh. You want to grab her other arm? The quicker we can get you inside, the quicker we can, they can get you help. Come on.
extra handcuffs earlier. charges of DUI, property damage, and nonviolent obstruction. She pleaded no contest to obstruction and accepted a reduced charge of reckless driving, eventually receiving 12 months of probation. What do you think of these charges? Share in the comments below. In the early morning hours of July 3, 2022, a Dodge County Sheriff's deputy, while on patrol in Beaver Dam, Wisconsin, used radar to record a vehicle traveling at 67 miles per hour in a 55 miles per hour zone. Noticing the vehicle was struggling to maintain its lane, the deputy initiated a traffic stop. During the stop, he identified the driver as a 24-year-old woman named Mariana, along with three other passengers in the vehicle. All right, there. Stop and you're going a little fast back there. We forget the 45 mile an hour zone. I was following the guy that was in front of me. Zero sixty seven. We got caught up. Him. No way. Yeah. Where are you guys coming from tonight? We're coming from Quick Trip right now. Quick Trip. What about before that? Home. Okay. Where are you had tonight? I have not. I literally. It was a whole family reunion. My whole family came from Texas right now. Yep. And I was like trying to take care of all of them tonight and stuff. Okay. And I'm trying to go to my dad's to pick up my kids. So how much have you drank tonight? Not Do you have that a couple much. drinks? Not, not that, that much. much. Not that much. No? If I'm driving, I'm not that much. Okay. That guy in front of me was literally driving the same speed as I was going. Okay. Passengers, you at ease with you guys? Didn't need a car. I'm just trying to figure out my dispatch lines and who I'm talking with too. So well, I just want to know who I'm talking with. Animal. Okay. Did you have your seatbelt on earlier? I did have my yeah. seatbelt on. Okay. Send your vehicle up your back. <laughs> While processing Mariana's information and awaiting backup, she unexpectedly waved to catch the deputy's attention. What can I help you with? Dude, um, when we were pulling out from Quick Trip, someone jumped him. Some guy, there's probably cameras at Quick Trip. Stuff. They, um, 
I tried pulling off and getting him away from there to go to my dad's house. So I'm Somebody gonna... jumped in my quick trip. Huh? Where? What's your quick trip? The new one. The new one. Okay. We'll talk to you about that in a little bit, okay? So you're not going to let us go? I'm not letting you go right now. Why not? Yes, sir. Why? Because we have another further investigation to do right now. Okay. So right now you're not free to leave. Into your ability to drive safely, first of all. You want me next? Nope, shoot? not right now. You're going to stay in the vehicle for right now. So stay right here. I'll be right back with you. Hey, sir. Uh... What's going on? Can we talk to the sheriff, please? The sheriff's not working right now. Um, so we will investigate. Right we will investigate the the incident at Quick Trip. The in, incident at Quick Trip. We're but, on a country road going to my dad's house right now, where my kids are. Okay. At. So you're you're wanting you're telling us about a potential robbery that occurred at Quick Trip. So we're gonna no, investigate that. Not oh, you said you said he was jumped. No. Okay. Yeah. So we gotta investigate that. Some guy literally Flash hit him all set. Okay. So so do you need do you need an ambulance? Huh? You need an ambulance? No. No, okay. Okay, sir, hey, hey. look at me. What's Start that? Flashing light at me. I need to be able to see got, in the vehicle. I just got jumped by the whole bunch of black guys 15, 20 minutes ago. So we will look into that here shortly. We were worried okay. for them following us. They're black people, literally. You, at want, the you want the cameras? You you yep, we, we will follow up with the with regarding that. We'll wait for you. Well, we're, I'm not going anywhere right now. Right now we're going to look into that aspect and we have something else that we need to be looking at. Uh, so you're going to hold on for a second. Answer, well, first of all, we're concerned about your ability to drive a vehicle. So I'm wait, yeah, so that's why I'm waiting for my partner right now. You want me to walk on to the sobriety test? Because we're going to wait for my partner before that happens that. right now. Do you want okay? me to walk on Nope, that? you're staying in the vehicle. Literally, okay. bro. You're, I'm telling you to stay in the vehicle. I've told you that multiple times already. I'm little. I don't... Yep, but there's there's three of you guys in the vehicle. Okay? So right now, right now, you're not you're preventing me from doing that right now. Okay, so right now we're waiting for my partner to get here. So we're gonna look into your ability yeah, to drive and then we're gonna look into the him getting jumped as well. With another gun. You need two guns to make sure that I can do a sobriety okay. test. Stay in your vehicle. So I can go. 225, where are you at? Due to her unwillingness to cooperate and the added complication of having three passengers in the car, the deputy ordered her arrested. When officers sense resistance or are faced with uncertain situations, they must prioritize the safety of everyone involved. Step out of the vehicle. Yep, get out. Yep, get out of the vehicle. Come, come, come back here. Right now you're going to be detained. Right now you're being detained. Why? I'm because you're being uncooperative. You're being uncooperative. Come back here. Come back. Get back here. You are not walking not away from me. Grab me like that. Do not grab me like that. Stop. Do not grab me like that. Do not grab me like that. 325, 1033. No, 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 You're being detained. For what? For what? For what? For what? Turn around. For what? Stop resisting. Stop. You are literally making me Right now you're being detained. You're being detained. You're trying to walk away. For why I'm not walking away? I was in my car. You better try fighting with one. I was in my car. I was in my car. Put your hands in your back. You're under arrest. No, for what? I was in my car. You know how many cars? How many alcohols? Stop. You're going to get tased. Put your hands in your back. Tase me for one. Put your hands in your back. You're going to get tased. Call the chef. Call the chef. Put your hands in your back. You're going to get tased. Call the chef. For one. I'm not doing shit, bro. I'm not doing shit. I'm literally standing there. He's whipping me around. Whipping me Put your hands behind your back or you're going to get tased. You asked. I was trying to provide a sobriety test. I was trying to provide a sobriety test. Do not what? stop fighting. Bro, stop more, fighting. I'm more sober than you are. I'm more sober than you are. Put your hands behind your back. I'm not fighting. I'm not fighting. Oh, stop. I'm not fighting. I'm not fighting. Stop. I'm not fighting. I'm not fighting. You're done. You think I have a do you think I'm a threat on your life? Do you Put your hands on your back. Stop. Do you think I'm a threat on your life? I'm a threat on your life? Do you think I'm a threat on your life? It's wide open. Holy crap. What is this threat? Put your hands on your back. You're under arrest. What? What? You're scared of me for what? You're scared of me for what? Help. You're going to get paid. Stop. chaos, Mariana flew into a rage, repeatedly swinging her arms at the deputy. In a heated moment, she even headbutted him in the face, knocking off his glasses in the scuffle. You, I'm not doing shit. Put your hand in your back! I'm not Put your hand in your back, you're getting tased! I'm not doing anything, I'm not doing anything! Get her hand! I'm not doing anything! Stop resisting! I'm not doing anything! No! My glasses are on the ground somewhere. <laughs> Things took an unexpected turn when one of the passengers exited the vehicle. When instructed to go back inside, he hesitated and appeared to reach for his car keys. It appeared he was trying to start the car. 
a move that could have easily escalated the situation. Stay Get in the car, car now! Get in the car! Stay on the ground! Get on the ground! Get on the ground! Get on the ground! Nope, get out of the car! Get out of the car! You decided to interject yourself? Okay. Hands on your back. Okay. Okay. I need to taste me. Okay, I'm not just breathe. Even... Breathe, okay? Alright. I'm literally sober as Alright, just. I'm sober as Nope. Stop. Where's the supervisor? Right now you're being detained. No, no, I'm not being detained. Two thirds out, one other male detained. Oh, one more in the car. No, hey, where's, the, where's the sheriff? Where's the sheriff? Where's the sheriff? No. Come back here. You decided you're interjecting the call? Right now you're under arrest for obstructing. Okay. Set up in a sitting position, okay? I'm gonna help you, okay? I'm gonna sit. One more in the car. I'll be a fing job. <laughs> I didn't even do anything. Literally, you guys are a fing abuse of fing power. No, nope, I'm not even right doing here. anything. Stop. 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 You guys are abuse of fing power. You're in a fing little fing town. Yeah, My sergeant's on his way. I just literally got a I understand, I understand. No, you don't. You work with them. Why don't why you, you, you call me and tell you me what happened? Them. That's fine, you don't have to. Right now you're under arrest. I'm not under arrest, man. Stop. Where's the Stop. Where's the supervisor? Stop. Oh, hell no. Where's the supervisor? Stop. He f***ing pulled me out of the f***ing car. Asked me to do a sobriety test and pulled me out of the f***ing car. Okay. I can drive sobriety. I can walk a sobriety test. Okay. I'm trying to make your handcuffs so they don't get tighter. Knock it off. Where's the supervisor? He's on his way. Okay, well then I'll so wait Every day. That's nice. Stop yeah. fighting me. I'm not fighting you, man. You want me to walk a sobriety no, test? I can do that right now. Why not? Why not? Why not? Because you and my partner. Calm down steady. after I just had a man. I was not fighting him. Watch his camera. He literally whipped me out of my car. He whipped me out of my car. Where's the supervisor? He's on his way. Where's the camera? It's right there. I want you to sit. Are you you guys stay calm. No, no, we're gonna sit. You on guys are literally a fing ground. I'll put myself on the ground. I've been fing ripped by all my fing family members. Get in the car. No. Where's the supervisor? Hey, you throw me like that? <laughs> you fing manhandle me. I should not be in chains right now. Literally, my whole entire fing fing generation. Really? Really? Who the fing are you to fing put me in chains? Who the fing are you to put me in chains? Hey, you went to You're the one who got a car, so. I don't f***ing get Mariana. Okay, you went up to my window and asked me. She's open. Uh, not yet. Um, search my f***ing deep. Search my f***ing deep. Stop. I'm trying to f*** my You already left got left one kind of battery to law enforcement. Do you want another? <laughs> <laughs> you want me to spread them, baby? Or I'm going to search you, okay? Well, you guys are literally my f***ing handcuffs. Literally yeah, my handcuffs. No, what the f***? Do I literally? You, you, you think I would have something on me? You think I would have something on me? You think I would have something on me? Please, please, literally, you guys are literally fucking. Uh, you think you can spread me open, baby? You can't spread me open. Why is that literally fucking arm down? Let me arm down. I just have to unlock the door. He literally ripped me out of my open. Girl, I was going to my dad's house after okay, my family okay, reunion. Okay. You got your pants up now so you can have a seat? No. After being placed in the patrol car, Mariana became frantic, banging her head against the window repeatedly. It's strange how some people forget that resisting only makes things worse in these situations. She's <laughs> <laughs> Let's see if I got a helmet. I was gonna say, I don't think I have one in my squad. <laughs> Where's your ID? I don't know who you are, so I can't call your PO. Okay, then you'll go to Jeff for that as well. Hey, you need to stop banging your head against the wall. Well, let's see how this goes, I suppose. Do you got a cage light? No, 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 no! Why? What am I? 
Well, two thirds edge. Female will be 95 for coat 10. We will not be doing fields to her lack of cooperation. Front seat passenger is not ID'd, but he's 95 for obstructing. See all about this jumping that occurred at Quick Trip. Allegedly, there, the guy was jumped at Quick Trip. Are you okay? I'm good. Oh, okay, listen, you're under arrest, okay? You're under arrest. It's it's over. It's over with. I don't care if it's over with. You can let me out of the helmet right now. All of a sudden, they're waving me up to the car, saying he was jumped at Quick Trip. I'm like, stay in the car. I'll be up with you guys shortly. She then decides um, she's gonna keep screaming, so I tell her, all right, step out of the car. Then she decides, we're gonna walk forward. I'm like, all right, now you're being detained. And the fight was on. Then she headbutted me, my glasses went flying, they're now broke. Is the other guy her boyfriend or something? No idea, he won't tell me who he is. He's going for obstructing because I told him to get back in the car. Then he gets in the driver's seat and looked like he was going to start it, told him to get out. And so, yeah, that was done. He decided to struggle a little bit, and now he's not telling us who he is. So, he didn't have to identify himself initially, but now he does. Okay. But now, All right. My glasses are broke, but I he's got demanding the, a supervisor, so. I got a right coming. Want? Yeah, he wants a supervisor. Oh, sweet. He's under arrest for obstructing and probably a probational, but he won't say who he is. What's up? What do you need? Okay, well, I'm right here. Talk to me, man. Roll well, the wind down, sir. Well, I'm right here. You can talk to me right here. I don't want to talk to you. Just want you to roll the wind down. Oh, it's down, man. All the way down. Cause the folks, sir. Oh, sorry. Don't obstruct the police and maybe we'd help you. So, enjoy your seat. I am the supervisor. What do you want? Are you the sheriff? No, I'm the sergeant. Oh, uh, I want the sheriff. You think the sheriff's going to come out at 3.30 in the morning? Hey, I, I pay my tax, man. Good for you. So do I. I'm not doing fields with her. I'm not doing okay. fields on her. I'm just going for the code 10 based off driving behavior and everything else. So, I'm going battery law enforcement on her. Come to damaged property. She broke my glasses. There's this truck. Okay. And the OWI. I'm Castle Forward. What's your name? What's your name? I'm Sergeant Wass. Where's the sheriff? The sheriff's not here. What's your name, man? I need the sheriff. Okay, well, the sheriff's not coming out, so what's your name? What's your one? Okay, so you realize failing to identify yourself, you're going to go to jail, right? Give me the sheriff, man. The sheriff's not coming. That's You, you don't have that right to demand. I do have that. Okay, well, I'm glad you think you're a lawyer, but you're not. And that's I love you, man. Shut up and listen for a second, okay? You've already got yourself in enough trouble. I pay for you. Great, I pay taxes as well. Good for you. So, are you going to identify yourself, or are you just going to go to jail and get fast ID'd? Is the sheriff coming tonight? Nope, sheriff's not coming tonight. Why not? Because he's not. The sheriff's not coming out, period. Well, I'll wait for him here. That's not an option. Okay, sounds good. You're going to jail tonight. I don't give a sh man. Okay, awesome. Sounds good. You'll go to jail tonight. The fast idea, they'll figure it out there. You said you were on probation. We'll find out who you are, and then uh, you're likely going to get a probation hold and then resist obstruct charges, okay? If, I, I don't know if you've read our policy manual before, but nowhere in our policy manual does it, does it say we have to have the sheriff show up out here. It's not how this works, bud. It, it is how it works. All right, sounds good. During the car crash, a sudden change of scenery revealed a number of opened wine bottles and plastic cups with traces of alcohol still inside. This is inhuman. I'm not a f***ing dog that needs to be put a muzzle on. I'm not. That, that's so you don't ram your head and get hurt. Because you literally ram my head. You're a f***ing official. I, you're I just got here. I literally just your got here. Yeah, we can watch this buddy cam. Yep, there, there will be camera. You're right. When law enforcement gives you a lawful order, I encourage you to comply. <laughs> Sheriff. The sheriff is not working tonight. I don't think the sheriff would let you go after fighting with Deputy Anderson. Is it a muzzle? No, it's not a muzzle at all. It feels like a muzzle. Okay, I can't it's not. Please. Please it's to it prevent you from hurting breathe. yourself or biting us. I can't us. breathe. I can't breathe. Please. Okay. Uh, Beaver didn't put that on her. Okay, she was crying about taking it off. We put it off or no? Okay. So okay. she hit her head multiple times Got against it. the window. I was not the one to put her on her. Um, okay. So I saw good. her hit her head once. All right, if we're concerned about her ramming her head, let's keep She's it done it several times. Yep, I do not want her getting hurt by ramming her head. At least take me to so Boogie so I can get the helmet off, please. I can't breathe. My f***ing boogers are sticking to my f***ing hair. I'm not a f***ing dog. He's taking care of that right now. No, he's got to fill a paper. Yes, yes. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Can I, can I explain it to you, please, for a second without getting yelled at? Yeah. Can I explain to you why you're in the situation you're in? Yeah. So some things occurred yeah. here, like you got out of the vehicle and went towards the front of the vehicle, and he told you to stop. Sorry. And then he, he then grabbed you and said stop, and you started resisting with him and headbutted him at one point. You can't do that. What? Are you kidding me? Yeah, it's on camera. So the best thing you can do right now is cooperate with law enforcement, not get yourself into more trouble. I want this helmet off my Perfect. Well, the reason why the helmet's on your head is to... No, can I, no, 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 no. I don't care if I have a social security from you guys or not. A social I security? Don't this, I don't want this helmet on my head. Okay, well, we can't... It's up to me. I'm we can't go. let you hurt... I'm no, it's go. not up to you anymore because you're in police custody. So, that's not how it works. I'm sorry that you think that's how it works, yeah. but it's not. So, all right. Well, that was nice of you. So, enjoy the helmet because you're going to be staying in it. Mariana. Mariana, are you good? Okay, I'll take the helmet off, but you're not going to ram your head, okay? Deal? Okay, if you ram your head, it's going to go right back on. Turn your head towards me. Come towards me. Come towards me. Okay, there you go. 
That was the deal. Keep your foot in the car. Thank you. Next, they took her to the hospital where a legal blood draw was performed. This is an important step, following the rules to make sure everything is recorded correctly. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Just hold on. What hurts? Hold on. My what? arm, my okay. wrist, right. my Just wrist. Hang on. Okay, hold on. Stop pulling from me, okay? I'm or not pulling from okay. you. I'm, I'm just letting you know belt. that if, if you, you pull right from there? me, it's going to I'm hurt more. I'm not pulling from you. I'm Shh. trying to walk. Shh. There are other people out here, okay? We're not going to be loud and obnoxious. Guys, I'm not trying to be loud and obnoxious. You guys are literally up. I can walk myself. I can walk Nope, myself. I have to hold on to you. I can walk myself. That's not an option. Why is it not an option? Because if you fall, then I'm going to be in trouble. If you guys throw me against the ground, you guys won't be in trouble. Okay. Don't fight with law enforcement. I promise not, you are not going to get thrown against the ground. Though. Okay, well, that's not an option right now. Oh, Stop oh, pulling. Oh, All right, let me check them. I'm going to see how tight. Entire no. finger in there. No. All right. Have a seat. I had to pee. I had to go to the bathroom. Okay. Is well, that that's not an option right now. You can so you want me to pee myself? You can if you want. Okay. You understand? I could fit this my entire hurts. gloved finger no. in your handcuffs. No. Wait. Let me see that, please. I, I did. I, it I, hurts yeah. though. If it hurts, then you guys need to loosen okay. them. Well, loosen them. You they know, hurt. People can. They hurt. I fake things I want to right? see the full. You guys need to loosen these. Here's these the hurt. It hurts. It hurts. It hurts. I'm gonna call have a seat, We're gonna sit down. You have, you have to wait till we get to the jail. No. We have to use the I hope. Where's your cameras? Right here. It's right there. What am I to you? What am I to you? Do I have a I'm gun? Do I have what? What am I doing to you? I literally Nothing. had Anderson slam me against gravel. Okay. I had him slam me against gravel, and okay. he's on his own side, and I don't care. But you need to loosen these. I checked they them. hurt, and I'm in a hospital I right now. I checked them. No, you did not check them. Loose this one. You tighter, no tighter. Yeah, I know. I know. Tighter. I'm loosing you it. Put them tighter. You put them tighter. Correct. It's not safety lock. That's what I'm doing, so you can't make them tighter. You put them tighter. You put them tighter. I just felt it. I know. That's what I just told I you. Know. You put them tighter. Oh, you put them okay, tighter. Stop. Them tighter. Listen. Can you stop talking and just listen? I'm trying to see how tight they are. Putting them tighter. I can feel it. Shh. No, no, no. I'm gonna step back down. I'm talking. I'm gonna step back down. Let me I safety lock. Do you want no, a safety lock really or not? Tighter. He's putting okay. them Okay. I'm putting my Double finger lock. in them. Someone help me, Bro, please. you are being so extra right help now. Help me. Help me. Chill help out. Me. Have a seat. Sit down. Help me. Sit down now. Help me. Someone help me. He's got literally a my doctor, entire finger can go in. Please help me. Doctors. They were not safety locked. They are now. Then you're gonna have to Can a nurse bring me at nope, least? That's not no. An well then, why is the female officer that was there? She earlier? is with your partner, who is also going to jail. I want to ride with the female officer. I don't want to ride with you men. Sorry, we don't have that option. She is why with... do I not have that option? I'm a f American citizen. I want to ride with the female. I don't want to men escorting me. You guys can't even bring me to the bathroom. I have to literally go to the bathroom. What do I have a gun on me? You can let go of me. I can walk well, in front of you. you can walk unfortunately, if you, you trip, you me. can't catch yourself. What? Right now, so I'm that's gonna... fine. That's fine. I'm gonna pee on myself. You guys are not letting me go to the bathroom. On the way to the jail, Mariana decided to play her last card. She took a deep breath, closed her eyes, and remained completely still, hoping to convince the police that she had passed out. Mariana! Mariana! There we go. Take a deep breath. She said, uh, she's back away. She responded to her number up. Mariana, take a deep breath. Stop playing games right now. We're done playing games. We're done. We're not gonna we're not gonna be playing games anymore. Well then let me go. You already have me in the cage back okay. here. You need to stay awake and we need to stop playing games. The sooner we can get to the jail then. Did you say you gave a sternum rub and that's yes. okay, that's what I thought. She was holding your breath and Yep. Sure you gotta make sure she's okay. Yeah, correct. Hi. Hello. Welcome. It's been a night. Weapons are good? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. That's fine. I've been trying to cooperate. I've been trying to cooperate. Alright. Fancy seeing you here. Here. You got harder than that. I had to pee really bad. Well, I'm literally going to do this first. Listen to her. Okay, well, I did it. Her. You told me to blow harder. I blew hard. Your breath blow. Hard, 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 hard. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that was 
Scott did the arrest. <laughs> Although the initial breath test showed a blood alcohol level of 0.138, a subsequent blood test confirmed it was actually 0.17. This case is a perfect example of how a more precise blood draw can reveal a higher level than what a rapid breath test might suggest. Mariana faced charges of attempted assault and battery for threatening a police officer, as well as a misdemeanor charge of resisting or obstructing law enforcement. She was also issued a $1,200 traffic ticket, including a charge for her first OWI, and was released on $1,000 bail. About a year and a half later, after a new appeal, she was convicted of resisting arrest, although her felony charges were eventually dismissed. Thanks for sticking around, guys. What was your favorite part? And if you were in that situation, would you have handled it any differently? If you're still here, hit that subscribe button for more daily doses of Karen Chaos. See you next time.